Hi there trailer owners. Today we're going to be taking a look at Optronics rectangular eight function submersible LED trailer lights. You can also pick up the passenger side here at eTrailer.com. It's going to have all the same functions except for your license plate light function. It's not going to be present on your passenger side. This is a 22 diode multi-function trailer light. It's going to suit eight different needs which includes your stop light, your tail light, your turn signal, your side marker light, your side reflex reflector, your rear reflex reflector, as well as your license plate light located on the bottom. And depending on the size and shape of your trailer and where you mount the light, it can also function as a clearance light. This light's going to make a great replacement or upgrade for your trailer. LED lights last quite a bit longer than your brittle filaments on the incandescent bulbs. They're also brighter and more efficient which means you're going to be putting off more light and using less energy, which means you're going to have more energy available for the back of your trailer so you could add additional lights or accessories if you so desire. It's also a great light for boat trailers as it's completely waterproof and submersible. So on your boat, whenever you go to load and unload it, you back down onto the loading dock and usually your lights get completely submerged under the water. But since we're completely airtight inside, we don't have to worry about any of that water getting inside and damaging our lights. This also makes it great for muddy job sites and areas with frequent hazardous weather. This light meets all the necessary requirements for trailers that are 80 inches or wider. It's going to be DOT compliant in all states, keeping you safe and legal. You have three slots on the back where you can put your mounting hardware in. There are carriage bolts that act as studs and they slide in the various slot locations to match your trailer. The distance between one slot to the next is going to be two inches. So it's two from here to here, two from here to here, and then from our outer locations it's four inches. To give you an idea on how it's going to fit and mount on your trailer, it measures eight and one sixteenths inches wide, two and seven eighths inches tall, and two and thirteen sixteenths inches deep. We're now ready to get our light mounted. The first thing you're going to want to do is determine which location you're going to put your studs in to properly position it on your trailer. For ours here, we're going to be using the outer slots to go into our pre-existing holes. Our wires, we're going to hardwire. Before we do that, we're going to go ahead and get it mounted up so we don't have to hold our light when we're connecting the wiring. We'll remove the nuts. Now that we've got our mounting location chosen, you want to make sure you take your wiring and run it through the channels that it has in the back so you don't pinch your wiring. We're putting our stop and tail wires off to the side so that way it'll meet our wires coming off our trailer there. And our ground wire, we're going to come out the bottom to connect to the stud on the back side. Since this is the driver's side, we've got our license plate light there on the bottom. So we want to make sure we put our license plate on. And then we're going to slide it through the mounting holes on our trailer. And then we'll secure it on the back side using the included nuts. The nuts that come with it have star washers made onto them to keep them from backing off. And then we'll tighten them down with a 716 socket. Now you do want it to be a little bit gentle when tightening these down as the carriage bolts do go into plastic T-slots in your light assembly. We don't want to bust those. Now that our light has been mounted up, we can start connecting our wiring. Our ground wire here will connect to any point on our trailer where it's in the frame it's going to connect. You could put it on one of the mounting studs, but if you do put it on those studs, you want to make sure you clear the paint off the back side here so we've got good contact to ground. Our customer already had a self-tap screw for the ground stud, so we're just going to reuse that since we know this is going into clean, unpainted surface. And then we'll tighten that down. For our remaining wires, we're just going to connect those to our trailer. One of the things that I like about this light in comparison to others is the color code that they chose for their wiring. Because typical trailer lights are going to have yellow for the left turn and brown for tail lights. And that's what we've got run here on our trailer, so our wire colors are going to match up. We're going to strip those back so we can make our connection. And we're going to be connecting these using heat shrink butt connectors. Since this is exposed on the outside of the vehicle, the heat shrink will seal it up, preventing moisture from entering in, preventing corrosion, and ensuring a long-lasting connection. So we'll start by hooking up our stop turn. We'll connect it to our trailer side. 
and then we'll connect it to our lights stop turn circuit. We'll then do the same thing to connect our tail light circuit. Can then use a heat gun to shrink down our butt connectors. You can then clean up your wiring, tuck that back and zip tie it all up and repeat the same process on the opposite side if you purchased one for your passenger side. The only difference between our driver's side and our passenger side when connecting it up is that the stop and turn circuit is going to be green coming out of the light instead of yellow. With everything mounted up you can plug it into your vehicle and test everything out. You want to make sure you have your tail lights and if you look down below on the bottom you'll also see your license plate light illuminated, your turn signal, and your stop lamp. With everything working properly we're ready to hit the road. And that completes our look at Optronics rectangular eight function submersible LED trailer lights.